hi everyone welcome happy friday i feel like this week has flown by i'm so so excited <laughs> to play princess peach today let me just open my window up how are you guys doing today i want to make sure the music is also not too loud i'm gonna check the settings let me know if my sound is good and um i'm so excited to start i'm gonna turn the sound up just a tiny bit let's see if that's too loud or not but um this yeah this week has really flown by i feel like this has been such a good week for like game releases since we got the stardew valley update and i'm kind of obsessed <laughs> with that too oh the noise the sound might not be on let me unplug real quick one sec one sec y'all let's see i hope that works let's see if that one if that helped mm, no one sec <laughs> it's like it's it is it really a stream if there isn't a technical difficulty let me let me unplug real quick and then try it one more time and sorry if you guys are hearing that beeping i'm not sure i hear it but i'm not sure if you guys are let's see if that works this time let's just par for the course you know okay let's try one more time okay just making sure it syncs up something it's like it's like very i just love how my um obs likes to keep me on my toes <laughs> just gotta roll with it but yeah today has been i think to, this week has been pretty good for me if i want to rate it i'm going to say i don't like to do too high you know i want to say an eight mostly because of these game releases this week <laughs> all right there we go because i was like a sound was not working <laughs> the toes sound so funny i just love how they talk This opening reminds me a lot of like, um, it reminds me a lot of Luigi's Mansion. All right. I finally hear Princess Peach. I'll go grab some tickets, it shouldn't take long. In the meantime, you could check out the lobby. I'll let you know once I've got the tickets. All right, so we played this part in the demo, the like opening. Um, let's just talk to everyone. Let's just walk around for a bit. Okay, this person we can talk to. The sparklet in this play is so good. This st their sparkle is unreal. Sparklers are our top stars. They have that extra pizzazz. They breathe life onto the stage. Thanks for the exposition. Okay, preparations underway. Still not open. Today we're here to watch the plays, but it's every seat's dream to perform someday too. So we have no entry. Then we have a <laughs> tantrum throwing seats. Which play should I attend? Let's talk to them. We'll be ushering you into our new sword fighting, sword fighter play momentarily. Thank you for your patience. Princess Peach, I've got the tickets. <clears throat> All right, so let's talk to Toad. 
here's your ticket did you notice how crowded i I just it's funny because how you said that up okay did you notice how crowded it is in here you must mean the show must mean the shows are great it sounds like our play will start soon we should he head to our seats We have an announcement for everyone gathered here today. It is now time for a performance of Terra Prime Proportions featuring yours truly, Grape and my crew, the Sour Bunt. <laughs> I was kind of laughing because it reminds me of like, um, <laughs> Team Rocket, like how she talks. This does kind of give me Luigi's Mansion vibes mixed with like Odyssey. It's a little bit more contained though. What's wrong? It's Stella. Huh, you want to know what's wrong? Well, some string mass characters are making a complete disaster out of our play. We can't produce a play with them around. I don't know what to do at this point. So you came to attend some plays and now you're witnessing this whole mess, huh? I'm sorry to hear it. I, I have to sort this out, but I don't think I can do it alone. It'd mean a lot if you'd help me. What do you say? Really? You'll help? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. My name's Stella. I'm a sparkle sprite who watches over this theater, and you are Peach. What a great name. With the power of sparkle on our side, we'll take back the play, and the show will go on. I do wish there was voice acting in these games. I really do. I just think that it would be an extra you know, immersive touch. Okay, I'm gonna get a little comfortable, kind of sitting up. The masked characters I mentioned were in the sword fighter play. Let's get in there. All right, so we're going to our first area. <clears throat> the castle of thorns. Hi Fish, how are you? It's been a minute. How you been? How's school? So this is the sword fighter story and sure enough it still feels off in here. Huh? Oh, oh no. Oh really? What? Oh, hopefully you get it soon. I was scared Ryan's wasn't gonna arrive on time either. Cause like they really wait till the very last like day to ship it off. But thankfully I'm close to I guess that's one of the shipping spots. Um let's see, someone's been hurt. Oh my. Could the mass ones be responsible for this? Oh, I've got it. Okay, I've got an idea. We should try using the power of Sparkle. This is such a cute hairstyle. Ah, it's almost the semester's almost over for you then, though, right? We're in March. Oh man, semesters go by so fast. I remember when I was in um school, I, we would. I feel like I just start and we suddenly had midterms, <laughs> and I was fighting for my life. <laughs> Um, I'm doing good. I'm doing good this week. I feel like, I feel, I don't know. How would I describe it? This week has been good. I, I mostly, because I just really like <laughs> the game releases this week. But yeah, this week hasn't been bad. Not too busy. Okay, let's see. Now we can use sparkles with that ribbon, Peach. 
Come on, use sparkles to help this thief. Yes. But you can do it, Fesh. You can do it. You got this. I love the sparkles. Oh, I feel better. This is just one of the powers of sparkle. It can help people when things shine and feel bright. Yeah, I was like, it's usually around May. <laughs> Uh, but that's still, let's see, we have, I feel like time has been fine by this year. Because we're like pretty much at the end of March. It goes by quick. With your help, we can fix everything using the power of Sparkle. Let's go. Looks like this area has gone back to normal. But we better check on the castle. They attacked us out of nowhere. I love it. Okay, we have to fight these guys. There they are. Looks like they're still causing trouble. Gotcha. Didn't stand a chance because the power of a sparkle. I love this. I thought I missed it for a sec. This is a shortcut that leads to the castle, or it was. There was a path here. Right, now we can keep going. Oh, is that like the inn? This is oh, it's a sparkle gem, proof of your fantastic efforts. These gems are packed with shining power, so I'm sure they'll be of use as we continue. All right, let's go. We've got a good view of the castle from here. We're getting closer. Oh, what's with all the thorns? Alright, let's go. We're gonna get our first power up here. Soon. <laughs> it's peachy. Let's go this way. Yep, let me make sure I get all the coins. Because they fade off really fast. Last flower. I don't know what that was, but it was cute. <laughs> it was that was like a bow or something. Oh, my bad. I'm like a little bit off with my aims. Nice. Yay. That's a sword fighter sparkle peach. I think we can make use of it together. I love this transformation. It's so adorable. Huh? 
I love it. Let's do this. I like how it's like semi aggressive at first. Like, you know, when we used our little ribbon, it, it was like she just kind of scares them. But with this, it's like she gets rid of them. <laughs> We missed a sparkle somewhere. Let's go. Not one step further. For a second I thought there was a dodge. Come on y'all. Watch your enemy's movement carefully, then use A, B, or A to dodge or cancer attack. Okay. Gotcha. Oh, gotta get the sparkle. Let's just hit everything. I see sparkles up here. What is we doing? Well, I guess this is just like a spot. The king, what can we do? Okay, we gotta get rid of these thorns. That's as far as you go. Take her down. Gotcha. Ooh, I could have dodged that. My bad. I love this like counter attack that she does. Okay, come on, final. Okay, let's see. I probably have to jump. I think I have to jump on them. I recall the demo. Okay, maybe not. Okay, let's see. Let's try one more time. Ah, oh, I messed up still. Dodge the enemy attack by jumping with A. Okay. Oh, I'm probably gonna die with this part. Okay, let's try one more time. Oh, no. Yeah. That's my bad, that's my bad. I don't know how I did this the first time. I did this so easy the first time. Oh, it takes away the coins when you die. So it's like a... All right. Okay, let's try one more time. He really did take me down. <laughs> Okay, let's try to get this last one again. Come on. Oh, okay, like that. Whoa, it's like so easy. How did I die the first time? Got it. Oh, you missed the sparkle. I'm gonna have to go back later. All right, we got the spiral staircase. How do I get to them up there? Oh, I'm not sure. Um, I'm going back around. Oh 
know it. I didn't know he was gonna come to turn back around like that. I can't get to this one's up here. Maybe I can't get to them. Maybe it's something I'm missing. Oh, okay, I see. I could have. Oh, uh, okay, okay, I see. We were about to die. Oh, no. No, not right now. All right, but I figured out how to do this. There we go. Nice. Gotcha. I have to get all the bad guys. <laughs> but I think there's like an infinite loop of them like charging at you. She has some really good movements though. Like she does like little flips and things. Oh man, I was trying to go to that spot, my bad. All right. There's the king. I just love, like this is just such a fun game. This is my show, you won't get past me. Alright, okay, so I'm trying to remember how I did this. I have to dodge. I messed up. Okay, now he's gonna do this. Gotcha. So cute, I love it. What's that? Thank you very much. We did it. I did miss some of the sparkles. Oh, I got a dress ribbon. I love the like mixture of like the action and dress up. It's so unique to me. My favorite part is coming out of the Patissier Patissier's um, Peach level in the demo. Okay, we did for sword fighting. We did it together. We're able to use the power of a sparkle. But the theater is not back to normal yet. I wonder if, the, if those glowing threads in the symbol in the lobby there. <laughs> Oh my god, so I'm sorry. And the symbol in the lobby here are related. I bet the other players need our help too. Come on, let's go check on them. Alright, let's go to the next one. 
Our, I wonder if our toads are gonna like try to help us. Okay, we can't get access to the upper floor, so let's go. <laughs> All right, I'm getting started. Each time. Ooh, they're holding a sweets festival here. The bakers prepare sweets and then share them with everyone. Okay, let's go. This is going to be amazing. I'm so excited. I'd be jumping up like this for sweets too. No mass villains here. Let's head to the gate for a festival opening. Oh, is it about to start? Waiting is so hard. Cause those are sweets. These sweets are ours. Why are they doing this to us? Okay, we got this, you guys. Hurry up, let's go. Okay, let's see if we can try to stop these guys because I, I remember in the demo I missed some of them. And I felt so bad. Oh my gosh, no! Oh, it wouldn't let me do the... It wouldn't let me jump up. I always miss one. I'm sorry, y'all. I tried my best with the other one. The last one. Don't be depressed, you guys. If only it was this easy. <laughs> okay, let's go. Alright, we need to move these right. Is that it? Okay. Alright, where are we going? Okay, we have the special pastry kitchen. Oh no, the baker. Where's the baker? I'm the baker. <laughs> <laughs> this is giving me it's so much like barbie vibes with this dress up with how she dresses up in his different occupations this is my favorite it's so cute So adorable. All right. The bell is going to start soon. Let's make cookies for the guests. Honestly, this part makes me hungry. I want cookies. I'm not a baker though. All right, so we'll be doing. Let's see if I get this right, because I was getting a bad in the <laughs> demo. Make cookies with us. You got to make tons before time runs out. All right. Place the finished cookies on the carts. Okay. Let's make a warm-up batch first. Let's do it. Okay. Is it like B? Oh, it's like this. So I'm holding it. Oh, I did it. Wow, nice. My first try. All right, let's do this. Let's see if I get this. Oh, I did it. Shocks. 
I wish it was this easy to make in real life. Awesome! Darn, I gloved that one up. Okay, it has to be like right before. Okay, I see. No, I missed it. Oh, oh, I thought that was about to burn. <laughs> okay, we have to go to the ones that have them as assistants and we make more cookies, it looks like. Okay, like this one. Oh, I thought I messed up for a sec. Woohoo! Oh my gosh, I have so much joy. Okay. Oh my gosh, we did it, we did it, we did it. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh man. Almost at like the top, top. Darn. We still did pretty good though. We did really good. We just missed one. We were just, just this close. Thank you, we're all set on cookies now. Can we get your help with something else? I like the music in this level too. Okay, let's see, hurry it up, keep the cookies moving. Oh, I think we're going this way. You guys are running me over. <laughs> the cake bases are ready, but... Oh, you must be... Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, okay, let's go, we're going, we're going. Now we gotta do these cakes. I was bad at this part in the demo. <laughs> Follow the recipes and decorate the cakes. Let us know when they're ready to go. All right, let's do it. Okay, so. Uh, This one feels like the easiest one, but I'm like... Okay. It's as complete as it's gonna be. Oh, okay, yeah, it was like closer together. My bad. Okay. Okay, we're like the middle. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is as close as it's gonna get. Okay, awesome. It's a little uh, weird in the middle, but <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this one good. It's like the circle on this one. <laughs> it's so difficult. But I love this level. Oh, I should have did it a little bit. Ew. Oh, how is it? Okay, it's a great job. They're so kind. <laughs> All right. Okay, this one. It's a no for me. Oh my god. I don't like this one. I'm so bad at this one. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Bad. Oh, you're so nice. This is the worst cake ever. They're so nice for that. I just wanted to make it to the last one. Uh, I'm so bad at the cake decorating. It's eh. Yeah, it's so bad. You guys appreciate 
whatever I gave y'all. Except that cake doesn't even have any frosting on it. You gotta come to the opening ceremony. It is fun that they <laughs> you can decorate the case that way though. Okay, I guess we're putting the let the finishing touch on. Oh, this place looks so oh, the cakes look so good. I love it. Not too bad. Okay, we have the next level. Okay, now we're getting into levels I haven't played <laughs> before, so like this is the that was the end of the demo, so this is gonna be a new one. What's this? The data is really spooky right now. Ah, a customer. Could I interest you in some wonderful dresses? I take coins as payment. I have lovely ribbons for you as well, Stella. Please take a look. Okay, so we can change our outfit here. Oh, we have a polka dots. I like this gradient. But I also, I really like these stripes. I like this, I think I like the vertical stripes. Let's buy something for right now. Wait, wait, let me see. Is there something else to get? Okay, so for right now, it's just the ribbon for Stella. All right, I'm going to do vertical stripes. We're going to just buy. I want to buy something. I think it's cute. Yes. I like I was like, let's save this later. But wait, let me change my outfit first. This is adorable. I love the stripes. It's so like vibrant. Okay, now we're doing cowboy looks like. Cowgirl in the wilderness. Ooh, I wonder how this one's gonna go. Those robbers are running amok. This is bad news for the town if they aren't stopped. Come visit the wild. Oh, hey, Francine. Oh, that sounds great. I'm doing good. How are you? Suddenly feel brave. I'm going to go after them. Should I be pushing too? Or should I be finding someone else to help? I probably is, I am probably supposed to be doing this. Not sure or what I'm doing here. Or maybe I go I go in here? Oh, okay. Right, it looks like for a second you can go in there. Okay, let's see. There's probably someone hiding me here. 
Oh, that's good. That's a that's a nice goal. I was gonna ask if you're using a walking pad because I've been really wanting. I've been feeling like a walking pad would do me good <laughs> right now, just because it's um sometimes it can be a little difficult to try to take the time to go outside and walk. You know, mostly for me because it's been like winter, so it's like outside of running errands and stuff. I I don't try to leisure walk. I guess. Oh, there goes someone hiding. Let's see, is there anyone else in here hiding? I'm gonna check back in that other spot. That's a great goal, though. I'm just making sure there's no one else hiding. Let's see. Maybe two people is good. Okay. Makes sense. Okay, y'all, you got it now. Hey Game of Titans, how are you? I'm doing good. This game is fun. I'm happy to be trying out Princess Peach. Oh, wait, are we done? Ooh, do I get to ride the horse? Please tell me I get to ride the horse. Oh. Nice. Should I be going towards them or under above them? Oh my gosh, they're shooting at us. How dare they? Get out of here. Oh, my. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's good. It's Friday. Okay, maybe I have to go above them. <laughs> I can't visit shooting at us like that. How rude. Okay, let's go from above. I think that's where we should go. Oh, it's like a lot of them in there. Get out of here. Okay, we're gonna go this way. We can't get next door through the basement, okay. Okay, so these levels are like not linear, which I kind of like. Let's see. Oh, I see, I see a sparkle spot around here. Which way can I go though? Hmm, let me see. I can't tell if I'm supposed to push this. Let me go back in the other room. Oh, sorry, I've. <laughs> I'm like always trying to run to the next. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to run to like the next thing. <laughs> Let me light this room up though. Let me, I like, I need to be, I need to chill. I need to chill. <laughs> I'm like, where we go next? Where we go next? Oh, there's someone else in here hiding. Okay, everyone's is scared. <laughs> okay, y'all, y'all gonna push this for me? Push it, push it. You guys got this. And then we get our next. Cowboy Peach, I mean cowgirl. <laughs> I love it.
Oh, this is gonna be so fun. So you think you're some kind of hero? Well, you can entertain me for a bit. Okay, so how are we doing this one? Oh, I see. I see, I see, I see. Oh, okay, so we're saving them. I think I need to be... Oh, okay, okay. I thought I was supposed to like be hitting the things towards him. But I see you got some skill. Don't matter, my loot and I are leaving now. Rude. Oh, I love this. Thanks. I don't think I saved everyone. I think there was one I missed. We gotta keep up, boss. Okay. They just barely got away. They ran fast. We get to ride a horse now? Woohoo! Let's go. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, we don't have to control it? Awesome. Oh, we gotta just dodge these. Okay. I see. Oh, darn. Seriously, this lady is relentless. <laughs> oh. Get out of here. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, okay. Fun? Come on. Come on, we got it. Oh, that was so fun. All right, let's go get him. Who would have thought you'd have chased me so far? Well, it's fine then. Time to settle this once and for all. Okay, we gotta dodge and, okay, I see. There we go. Nice. Okay, so he's gonna, what, what's he doing now? Running. Bull. Dodge the bullets. Oh, that got me. That one got me. Awesome. Oh, and okay, now he's gonna do a ball run. This is so. F oh! <laughs> this is so fun. Let me pay attention. Okay, now it's gonna be three bullets this time. Yeah, I knew it. Ooh, that almost got me. Okay, it's gonna be a barrel. What we got coming out? Ooh, I gotta be careful. I gotta hold it, I think. This isn't good, I got one heart left. Oh darn. Fine, it's, it's okay, it's okay. Gotcha. Okay, now he's gonna do his ball run. Alright, two. Oh, I keep missing it. Start it. 
Okay, I, I like panic at the last second. There we go. All right, so we're gonna have to like hold it at the, because like once he shoots again, it blocks it. Ooh, he almost got me. Almost got me that time. Now it's three bullets. Haha. And we got all of the gems. That was fun. <laughs> well, <shucks. laughs> oh, oh my god, I love the voice. Her voice is so cute. All right, what's our next one? I think I like Calgro. Um, Calgro Peach is so, so awesome. All right, so that one's done. I think this game is actually for um like pretty short. I've been seeing full gameplay videos that popped up where it's like six or seven hours, which I kind of already. Oh, we, so we have a ninja level. I kind of already figured because Kirby is uh, um, like most of the like mainline Nintendo games have been pretty short with playtime, but I do see the replayability of the levels. Every classic ninja story begins in a village. Oh, it looks like we won't be going that way. I gotta see. It's taking over the village. I see some things. Oh, I can't wait to do this one. This one's gonna be fun. There's a path tainer nearby. Oh, it'll be this one then, huh? Ooh. You traveled the well, so cool. Follow this road to reach the manor. A seven. Yeah, I said an eight. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to rate my week too high, but it wasn't a bad week. Thanks for sharing. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> we have to be stealthy here. All right, okay. We can't force your way through. Okay, so we have to. Is my training up to snuff? Okay, this is different. All right, so we have to be stealthy here. So, okay, I'm gonna wait so he turns around again. Oh really? Man, editing it can be so tiring. It's crazy, isn't it? <laughs> Can't wait to see the video. All right, let's go. Okay, they say we're the ninja of legend.
<laughs> yeah. I totally understand. I was like, oh, this video isn't that long, so it's not going to take too long to edit. And <laughs> it takes me like a whole day. <laughs> I usually like when I want to edit, I make sure it's like I set a time. Like I set a day aside and I sit down and do that. This is pretty. Oh, it's already out. Okay, awesome. I have to like put on notifications for your videos because I don't see them pop up on my like page, you know? Okay, we are Ninja Peach now. I love it. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Can I walk on top of water? Yeah. Oh, I see something here. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. But you know, like the YouTube algorithm is just strange. All right. Yeah, it doesn't, yeah, I don't know. You know how your YouTube algorithm is though. I usually try to set notifications or sometimes I look at my subscribers list, but it also still like, it's like kind of weird with that. Okay, so we're helping now. Conceal yourself in the grass. I'll make sure to find your video after a stream. But you know, it's also like so strange to even search on YouTube. Cause it's like, if I try to search up people's accounts, it doesn't pop up automatically. I don't know why. Isn't it fun? Oh, this is, oh my God, this is so cool. Okay, so we can fight back this time. Let's see. <laughs> it was like, you're not in the grass anymore. <laughs> Ooh, almost got me, almost got me. Hide in the grass, hide in the grass. Oh no. Yeah, it's so strange, I don't know. It's like searching for people is weird, but oh my God, what did I just do? What was that? Did that do that automatically? What was that? Wall height technique, what does that mean? Oh my gosh. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, let's see. So wait, can I go up? I guess I can't go up there to fight him. I just like to fight. This guy's sleep. Okay, his enemies up ahead. Hey, Bro Rustic, how are you? Can I hit this? No. Getcha. Oh. Where'd I go? Oh my gosh, that is so cool. That is so cool. How did I do that? I bet there's like a bunch of hidden things. Okay, let's do wall height technique. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Okay, I guess we just have to go past this guy. I know. This is the weekend. You have any plans? Anybody have any plans for the weekend? Okay, we're gonna go this way. I hope I didn't miss anything. Oh, darn. <laughs> this 
since since this game, I guess. <laughs> An ancient ninja pot hiding technique. What does that mean? Oh, okay, we got an extra hidden thing. This is so cool. So this is like a dress up action adventure game, which I think is really unique. I heard it's by the same creators of Yoshi's Crafted World. This is, I think this gameplay is so unique and it's, it's like a nice change up, you know? Oh wait, can he see me? Could he just see me? Okay, how am I supposed to go through here? That was nice. That was that was a nice one. That was a nice one. Do not let your guard down. They are after the scrolls. Okay, I see a scroll here. What was that? Okay, let's go. Oh, we we're chasing, we we're chasing, we we're chasing. I thought, I thought we were, you know. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cool, y'all. Oh, okay, okay. That was on me, that was on me. This is so cool. Wait, I, I want to check chat, but I can't read. Oh my gosh. Okay. I love, I love this so much. I almost got him. Right? This is awesome. I never got to play the original Princess Peach either. This is so, oh my gosh, this is so cool. Okay, it's like every time I think I know <laughs> what's happening, it's like even more like awesome. Like, oh my gosh, okay. We just rode like a mountain. <laughs> Was I supposed to hit him? I couldn't tell. Let me see if I can get him. Oh my gosh, he's like... <laughs> he's slow. Okay, he has to wait for him to slow down. Gotcha. Oh, that is so awesome. It's done. Thank you. <laughs> You're so right. You're so right. This really is. It's like... This, this is really awesome. You're right about that though. This is this is such a unique game with the power-ups because it reminds me a lot of like Kirby, but it's like, I don't know. It's like so interesting how they decided to do this. Like, I really love it. And I think it's like each level because like you don't know what you're going to do. It gets better. Oh man, that was so fun. I think that was my favorite so far. I wonder if they're going to have like a DLC for this. Or like a multiplayer or something, you know? Peach is just showing that she could have been saving herself this whole time, okay? She was running to Bowser's castle. <laughs> she didn't want to get saved, okay? Okay, so we opened up a new door or something. Okay, I want to change my outfit because we got a new fabric. So let's change again. I feel like that ninja fabric is going to be so cute. Or oh, wait. I thought it said I got it. Maybe not. Maybe it's another spot to change. Let me see. I always just love the, um, I love the, like, idea that <laughs> Peach, Peach Loki is, is not fighting. <laughs> that she, she actually likes Bowser. 
that someone has mentioned before. I think it's so funny. Okay, so this time we change wardrobe. Oh. I didn't realize the hair changes too. I wonder if you can make your own. Well, I'm gonna do ninja. The ninja dress I think is cute. What else do we have? We have a collection. Okay, we have ensembles. Okay, let's see. Uh, so this is just like the ones that we have tried out already. This is my favorite uh, look. Like, it's so cute. I love her hair. It's adorable. We have music. I thought the, I really think the music is so good in this. Okay. We have movies. Okay. These are cool little side things. You're so right though. But I really like that they get like it's like th this is this is what we needed for Peach, you know? Cause like they always like give Peach like the side, like she's just like, you know, getting captured every time, like the damsel in distress. I love that they they're like doing something more with her character too. And I really I did like her imprint in um the Super Mario movie. It was she was it was funny. Alright, let's go to the store. So those threads were connected to the store. Maybe it's somehow linked to the place being messed up. I just want them to give Zelda a game. If they give Zelda, like, I wanted Zelda to be playable in Breath of the Wild. I want them to do more with their, like, female protagonists. <laughs> I need them to do more, okay? Okay, see, that's strange. My sparkle is getting stronger. <laughs> yes peach is a new barbie i was saying that earlier i thought that was so funny like she is like the whatever she's dressed up is <laughs> it's a new occupation she has like 500 jobs now seems like it's responding to this creepy door or something i might be able to open it if we boost the power my power with some sparkle gems oh okay that's why we're collecting these okay that makes sense i hope you have enough let's see can you give me some of the sparkle gems you've collected? We should have enough. Oh, 10. Okay. You haven't watched it yet? Oh, man. I'm glad I didn't spoil it by mistake. <laughs> I think it's on Netflix. I've seen it on Netflix and um, the NBC app, the Peacock app. I think that's what I saw it at. You know, I, I, it wasn't like a groundbreaking movie, but I did like the characterizations and the music and stuff. I want a Luigi's Mansion movie. Okay, so what we got going on here? Who be you? How you get through that dark door? <laughs> yeah, she's like more like a leader. We were write stories with Madam Grape, so if you here to stop us, then I punish you with Madam Grape's power of dark rule. Okay, so we have a boss battle. All right. I didn't expect this. I didn't know what we were doing. Okay, now let's figure out what is what she's doing. I know. I really hope they do one. Like, they did a little... What looked like a little... Um, okay, so we're using our sparkle for this. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. Oh my gosh, what are we doing now? Okay, so they're gonna turn into chickies. 
Oh, this is interesting. Okay, let's let her come back around. Come on, come on. What is it doing? Wait, am I doing something? Oh, okay, I must be pressing B. <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing. I thought it was a cutscene. Oh, we still fighting, we're still fighting, okay. What are we doing now? What are we doing? Oh, gosh. My bad, my bad. Oh, this is awesome. This is a cool fight. Oh, I don't know what she's doing here. I don't know what I was supposed to do there. Okay, I think that was just undodgeable. Oh no, okay, let's try to get this last one. Let's try to get this last one. Woo. Oh man, we missed it. This is so trippy. We're gonna flip back around? I think so. Not gonna lie, this is a little bit of challenging. I feel like the last, the mini battles were like really easy. This actually is giving me a little bit of a challenge. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're gonna get her this time. She's still going. Yeah, she's back. It's like a possessed disco ball. Okay, what we got? No, what do you have? Oh goodness, that almost got me. Oh, we're flipping back over. We're flipping back over. That almost got me, y'all. Okay, she's gonna do this dodge. What you doing now? Oh, she's bouncing around. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, I see she got this too. Darn it. I globbed up on that one. Okay, we're dropping back down it looks like. Oh. Come on, come on. Okay, right, now she's doing her bouncing. Okay, those are gonna hatch. All right. Ugh, I can like hit it prematurely. Okay, let's let her come back around. Come on. Oh. Good thing I moved <laughs> before this. Oh, one of her chickies was coming around. This one is giving me a run for my money for sure. Okay, she's coming back. Let's bounce out of here. Okay, get rid of these. She's gonna come back around. Yes. That was a fun battle. We did it! <laughs> this one is back to normal because of you. Yay, thank you so much. This is the end of the game. <laughs> we still haven't seen any sparklers though. I wonder where they went. I'm worried about them. 
Maybe they evacuated to one of the other floors. Let's go look. This person's taking pictures. What are we doing? Boom, now where will I find the next one? Yeah, that was the first boss. I didn't really expect like a boss level, like a big bad one, you know? Oh, hello there. I'm Sparkle Theater's Pictionaire. I specialize in performance photos. I currently be seeking a new performer who really shines for the camera. I recently snap edited images from a particularly riveting performance, in fact. Could it be young lady that you who are a performer i hope then that you don't mind me taking photos of you all in your glory on stage if you collect all the sparkle gems during a play i'll capture a magnificent photo of you oh, okay and of course this thanks for your cooperation i'll give you an album and any photos i snap i look forward to your stunning performances oh that's cool I was wondering what would make me incentivize me to go back to the levels, you know, like what if you just play through them and it's like that's it for you. Rehearses for the sword fighter play are happening here. Apologies for initial delay. Take out as many enemies as you can. The rehearsal will end if you take any damage. We have wonderful words prepared based on your performance. Now show us your very best. Oh, that's cool too. Um, I won't do that right now. Thanks. Okay, who's this? Ever heard of a heart charm? They're all the rage among new actors. If you carry one, it'll get you three bonus hearts. So do you want a heart charm? Sure. I'll take it off your hands if you decide you don't need it. Okay, so this is like to give me a little extra help. I'll take it. Let's, let's take it. Okay, we're going to go upstairs now. I wonder how many floors there are. Okay, I see this third floor here. And it has these threads up here, so that means that we can't go up yet. I wonder if this is like the last floor. It looks like it to me. Okay, so do we get to choose which one we want to do? Okay, I see a sword one. I think we can pick any one of these, it looks like. I Oh, we have ice figure skating. Okay, we have Detective Peach. Then we have a figure skating. I might do figure skating. This one, um, is it like a bandit? Not sure. Let's do figure skating, Peach. Oh, wait, let me see what they probably give us a little idea. The Detective Sparkler could solve this. Okay, what is going on here? Now this floor is creepy. Okay, have you seen the sour bunch? Oh, for a second, I thought it was something this way too. Okay, there's a sword fighter spark. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go to sword. The, we're gonna go into the ice skating one. I think my headphones might be a little too tight. All right, let's see. Snow flower on ice. Peach time. The ice show is going to start soon. Oh, Peach, there's an ice show. Maybe this play is safe. <laughs> Fantastic. They're so lovely. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is such a cute animation. Come watch. They're so lovely.
Okay, let's see if we got the last bush here. Ooh, this is so fun. Yeah, it is like a Christmas town. The venue is this way. Okay, where are we going? Oh, there goes the haters. <laughs> Ruining this show. Okay, let's get ya. Like, I'm like falling on the ice. Okay, let's see. There was just one more. There's our spins. Oh, that's so cute. Let me just. Oh, that gave me a lot of hearts. Okay. Performance is a disaster. Time to check out our show. <laughs> oh my gosh. They're menaces to society. Where are the other dancers? Where are they? Okay, what was that scream? It came from the dressing room. Let's go. Where is everyone? Who knows? I most certainly don't. They, they're just like coming in wreaking havoc. I think they're in this snowman. Okay, so I can't... I guess I can't um, get them. Thanks, you finally... Okay, let's see. Oh, we're getting a lot. Oh, wait, I've got a day wait here. They're so cute. This is such a cool um outfit. It okay, has a faker skate, a sparkle, you can use it. Okay, let's see. so much I wish I could figure skate I don't know how people look so graceful when they figure skate I feel so like flunky <laughs> Time to shine. <laughs> oh I knew this would work out that's this oh my god let's go let's go let's go the cosplaying of this peach game is gonna be out off the charts y'all okay it's the real dancers the real dancers have returned not a moment you all been waiting for jump exhibition okay we got something different here Oh, like this? Oh my gosh! This is really... <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Okay, we have a spin exhibition. It would be like this? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Jump in spin. Oh, is it jump? Hey Miko, how are you? Glad you could make it. How's your day going? This is so fun. This is such a fun game. 
Okay, synchronized skating. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can I do it? Okay, let's see if I'm doing this correctly. <laughs> I don't think so. Am I supposed to be in the middle? Oh, my bad. Oh, okay, press B, okay. Thank you, Stella, cause I didn't know what I was doing, y'all. There we go. Okay. I was like, am I skating around? <laughs> We didn't practice this. Yeah. Oh, this is so cool. Because, you know, they could have just went the route of, like, ballerina. But I think figure skating is, like, yeah. something I don't really see for dress up. Yeah, we're doing a spin. Oh, my gosh. This is so awesome. Sparkling spin and jump celebration. Oh, we're still doing more. Okay, we're doing more. We're doing more. Jump. Ooh. Oh, I missed this one. Okay, okay. And now it's time for the finale. Keep your eyes on the dancers. I know you've all been waiting for me. Come on over here. This is in us. What's happening? Oh no, they took over. Now you're all mine in with that. Time for the big stage. Okay. Let's go. The poor dancers, we better follow them. I hope there wasn't something I could have done in there. Oh, that's so cute. Is it a speed run? Okay. Okay, because I couldn't tell if I was supposed to hit. Okay. Okay, let's swoo. Oh, this is so fun. I love how graceful she looks. Okay. Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Woo, we did it. Darn it, I missed that last one. I can go back around. I can go back around. Shocking. There we go. Man, I was trying to get it the first try. It was like so close. This is something, no? Uh, okay, the CR to strike a pose. Okay. So it's like this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I missed this in the first one. Did it. 
my coordination is so like but ignore <laughs> This was where they went, but what is this place? Okay, we got our boss battle coming up. Hey Welcome to my stage. Huh? And you here, are you here to help the dancers? <laughs> Good luck, you won't match my skills. All right, how we doing? Am I supposed to be jumping with him? Let's see. Yeah, I feel like. Oop. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to save one of them. Oh, before he can get to them. I'll help you, I got you. No, I got you, I got you first. Oh, he can beat me to that one. Oh no, he beat me to that last one too. We're gonna get you this time. Okay. He goes so fast. Okay, I see, we have to like, wait for him to get dizzy. Okay, now let's get our friends. Ooh, I almost got, okay, let's look at this one to see if we can get that last one. No, he got two. Okay, we gotcha. We gotcha. He's mad. Gosh, I love it. Oh, I got, I got pretty, did pretty well with this. So I, I have two I need to find. Thank you so much. Oh, I love that. Got a dress ribbon. That was a fun level. Wasn't it? That was a lot of fun. Honestly, I forgot even about the rest of the game. I really like this change up in gameplay. Like it's like a nice change of pace. And also it's like, it makes everything so unpredictable. Cause you know, it's like when you start to play a game and you kind of like, okay, I get the understanding of it and then it gets repetitive. I really like how that they were like, cha they change it up. Like this is like, this is so refreshing. For a game like it really oh my gosh i, I just can't stop gushing about <laughs> how like because you know i was a little bit worried for this game because i want to do detective peach next i think i was a little worried for this game because they barely showed us any gameplay and what they did show us was just like oh she dresses up and stuff but like they i feel like they they were really vague about it and i think a lot of people when they played the demo was also confused <laughs> Even though when I played the demo, I was like, oh, this is so fun. But I really like, I really love this. This is like, it, you get so immersed in these like little plays that it's like, like this is, okay, let's say the case of the missing mural. This is so, this is really such a clever idea. I'm so happy Peach finally has a game, you guys. Like, oh my gosh. This is what she deserves. I really honestly don't want this to end. Aww. Everyone here looks scared. Mm. But why? The detective here always solves mysteries and keeps people feeling safe. Oh, okay. This music. We're going to be Sherlock Holmes now. Let's see how this is going to turn out. I love mysteries.
fork over everything you got. <laughs> They're so old timey. Get out of here. Oh, I love her little sway. Where could the police be? I can pinch in too. The ancient mural style sounds intriguing. There goes the cops. The museum is closed today. This is urgent. There's been a threat. I'll be taking point on looking into it. A junior detective like you can't handle this. You better just head home, kid. Guess it's no use. Oh, he gave up really easy. Don't give up. Where are you going? Hey, Jin, how are you? How's your day going? No one give up yet. Okay, will you come with me? Yes. Oh, let me get that first. Oh, we got, we're going this way. The detective is out right now. This And while I really want to help them, I can't even solve the mystery of this office. Okay. Should I do sparkles? I'm like, I don't know how to solve. Okay, I see something. Okay, I do see. Star. Okay, star lightning bolts. We got a cloud. And then we got the sun. We did it. Oh, we missed someone. We missed a thing. Now you're about to be Sherlock Holmes, y'all. I love it so much. Detective Peach. She really is Barbie. <laughs> okay, wait, where did Junior Detective go? Are you supposed to help? <laughs> Looks like they're hiding. Okay, I'm gonna see this letter here. Oh, there's a note on the floor. Let's see here. If you're a true detective, you'll find me, Junior. Oh, wait, let me check what the controls are. B to investigate, release B in front of the suspicious objects to look them over closely. All right. Okay, I see. Strike of intuition. It's giving Ace Attorney. <laughs> Objection. Gotcha, Junior. Amazing, nothing gets past you, Detective. You really can detect things with your strike of intuition. Now come on, a mystery awaits us. Let's go. Oh, it's a detective. Please go on inside. Oh, <laughs> I'm, so, I'm like, oh, I am. Detective, you came. And you're just in time. The curator is waiting in the room next door. 
Okay, so where is the curator? This is the curator? Oh dear. I'm just a staff member. If you're looking for, for information, you should talk to the curator. Is this the curator? The officer won't let anyone leave. I'll know what's going on. They locked up the museum and now I can't go home. I want to see the mummies. I was hoping to see the mummies in the back room. I hope they open up soon. The mummies are calling me. Oh, okay. So it's this way. I've got this place under tight surveillance. Nothing escapes my notice. Nothing. We should talk to the curator first. Interviews are the foundation of a good investigation. Nothing's a mess here. Everything's locked down. I even made sure to tighten the latch on that window over there. Nothing in this. Okay. The detectives still aren't here. Detective, you're here. Thank goodness. You see a threatening note has been placed on the Theopoda mural. It reads, we're coming for the Theopoda mural. Consider yourselves warned. If something were to happen to our mural, What's this, a power outage? So nice of them to leave a note, y'all. <laughs> Before stealing stuff. Oh my gosh, they're going crazy. Oh no, the mural is gone. Please, you have to track down the culprits. Where did those fiends go? Okay, so let's do... There's something written on the wall where the mural was hanging before. It says you've taken the Thepoda the mural. Sour gang. Okay, let's see if we can find any clues. Looks like a strike of intuition here. It's a locks window. All right. Okay, so let's go. Detective, it's time for us to get to work. Let's talk to the witnesses and explore the museum. We have to figure out where the culprits went. Okay, so let's talk to this guy. The window was latched tight, so how did they get in here? Okay, see, please, you have to track down the culprits. It was stolen the instant things went dark. How maddening. Okay, let's talk to these guys over here. It was so dark and I couldn't see well, but I felt someone brush past me as they went into the room on the left. Okay. The power outage was unsettling. Ugh, I hope the mummies are okay. <laughs> We're terribly sorry for the inconvenience. Please wait just a bit longer. I just want to go home. <laughs> The slate's tilted now. I could swear it wasn't like that before the outage. Okay, let's investigate. It's a stone slate carved with the ancient text. What's this? It seems like you could move it. Hmm. Peach got it. Oh, we might have missed something in this room. I'll come back around later, though. Mm -hmm. It's an air duct. Maybe the cupboards use this. Let's see what's inside. I see footprints. Oh. They are really wreck wreaking havoc in here. The display case is broken and they stole some stuff, it looks like. The items on the display here were the fandangled mask of disguise. It says wearing one of those masks allows its wearer to alter their appearance. Of course, the culprits must be using these thing these masks to disguise themselves. A treasure chest. Let's open it. Money. I see a key here. 
Oh, it's a spades key. Maybe we can find a use for it. Okay. Let's look. Mask of the Skies one is Mask of the so to their periods. Oh, that's it? Okay, I thought we have something else. Anything here? Oh, uh, I think not. Okay, let's go to the next room. I'm sorry, these fiends are in here somewhere. Ooh, who do you guys think it is? Surely the corpses are in disguise. Let's collect clues and find them. All right. I see a spades key. I see a key back there. It's a diamond key. Maybe you can find a use for it. Okay. Got that key. There's something here. It said nose of truth. It says anyone who smells of deceit will meet a terrible end. Okay. Be careful, Peach. You lose hearts if you guess wrong with your strike of intuition. Okay. So we can just poke at anything. When the lights went out, someone stole my popcorn. <laughs> the nerve. <laughs> okay, so I get it. We have to go to each person and then infer. One of my precious cameras I sell here is missing. It was right here before the power went out. Hmm, okay. Interesting. I haven't seen anyone suspicious. Okay, this person has a camera. This person said they got their popcorn stolen. Okay, let's see. What this, what's this one? Anything over here? No one has come or gone through here. I saw footprints. Is this popcorn? I wonder if someone dropped it. Okay, so no one's going through there. These people have cameras. They said a camera got stolen, but I see one camera. Why is there a new statue? There are only two before. I'm gonna check that statue. Let's the socks this person. See that statue with the sunglasses? That one's the real deal. It's a carving of a hero holding a round shield. This hero fought with nothing but the shield. Statues of two great playwrights. Apparently they watched the play together over a single bag of popcorn. Huh. Statues of two guys. Two. This is actually kind of tricky. Let me try to go to everyone before I, I think about what, how to make of all of this. Oh, why? I mean, nothing out of the ordinary here. Everybody's suspicious. There's some strange sounds coming from this room. Could it be a ghost? I'm like afraid to. Give an opinion. <laughs> yeah, let's open the treasure chest. Before it got dark. Before it got dark, there was an officer in here. Where did they go? Okay, that means keep the fit here. Thank you. Thank you for getting me out of there. I may not look it, but I'm actually an officer. Okay, so one of the cops. Someone attacked me and stole my uniform and locked me in there. It was all black after that. Do we have this key? I think we do. Okay, so it's one of the cops. But it can't be the sleeping cop. 
Okay, let's see. A camera is missing. Oh, man. Okay, let's look at the footprints. Okay, so this person said they dropped their popcorn. Um, I'm afraid to use my strike of intuition. Okay, this person isn't it. Oh, wait. Is it like I'm accusing them? Okay. Let's look at the statue. Okay. <laughs> it's one of these cops, for sure. Let me see. You see that statue with the sunglasses? That one's a real deal. Okay. Because there's two people with cameras. Now it's comic one through here. Oh goodness, this is a difficult one. It's definitely one of these cops. And okay, let's see, a camera was stolen and there's popcorn. Hmm, this one is a little tricky. But then there is the sleeping officer. And I'm like, is he like a red herring? Okay, we have footprints there. Oh wait, there's a little spot here. Indeed. Yeah, doesn't it? A ah. treasure chest, let's open it. What else is in here? Oh, there's two treasure chests over here. I think that's it. Looks like that's it for here. All right, y'all. What do we think? Okay, a cop is missing an outfit. So that means for sure it's one of the cops. Which one? Okay, we have this guy has sunglasses. This guy has a camera. Cause they're like one of their cameras is missing. Are we uh, okay? I'm gonna say this one. Let's see. Okay. Gotcha. So it was their clothes and camera that gave them away. Nice work. There's one more thief remaining, but I'm sure you'll be able to catch them. All right, so got one, we have another. Okay, so someone said their popcorn was stolen. So now I am trying to think, okay, this guy said their popcorn was stolen. When last one not someone stole my popcorn. But there, then there's like popcorn bits here. Because I'm like, okay, was someone here? Oh, because so it could be one of these statues. Okay, okay. I think I got it. I think I, I think it's this one. I think it's this one. Right, because they said one of them was supposed to have glasses, but then they said they stole a popcorn. Let's let's see. Okay, yes. It's this one. It's this one. Because that would make sense. I was supposed to, it's supposed to be one popcorn. I think this is it. I think this is it. Yes. Gotcha. 
Ah, oh, that was one bag of popcorn too many. Excellent work, detective. We're rounding them all up. Let's go speak with the museum curator. Of course. Gotcha. We, I feel like um, Scooby Doo right now. <laughs> if it wasn't for you meddling kids. You did it. I had a good info for you. I said a culprit was disguised as a statue. Hey, Marshmallow, how are you? No worries. Enjoy your dinner. Enjoy your lurk. Tell the truth. Okay, so. Tell us where the mural is. We don't know nothing. <laughs> As if we tell you how we hid it somewhere in the museum. Okay, so now we're finding the picture. I mean, I don't know nothing. Okay, so still here. If it isn't a detective, you arrived at the perfect time. Thanks to you, we've got all the culprits in custody. However, we still don't know where the mural is. You have to find it. That's good. Happy Friday. Okay, now we have to find the mural. Let's talk. Let's get some clues. Okay, talk to the cop. Side door is open. Now that thieves have been captured, we're letting folks through the side door again. Okay. What do you have to say? Cup is on the wall so quickly. I guess that makes them artists, sort of. <laughs> I knew this case wasn't closed yet. Let's hunt for clues and figure out where the mural is. You know, whenever I'm stumped on a case, I find that fresh air is great for clearing my head. Okay, maybe we should go outside. I'm gonna talk to everyone. We've searched the whole museum. Where could they have carried it off to? Okay, so the side door is open. He's, this one's so upset about the mummies. I can go to the back room now. Hooray, now I can see the mummies. Alright, let's talk to some people. Could the culprits really have carried off such a big moral? That is a good question. I could really use some fresh air if only we could open a window. Oh, let me check that window. <laughs> nice. <laughs> There's no way the mural would fit through the air duct. It's way too big. The mirror was pretty big. I doubt I've been able to fit it through this door. Okay. Let's check this window again. That window's a little too high for us to reach on our own. I bet we could reach it with the stepping stool. Oh, okay, let's find one. Oh, oh, oh. The stepping stool that the mummy fanatic left. If we sound this stool, we may be able to examine the window. All right. Ooh, that sounds so good. You guys are making me hungry. <laughs> I'm gonna have pizza after this. Let's try opening the window. All right. Look at that, fresh air. Yeah, you should. There's something written on the wall where the mural was hanging before. They never took it. <laughs> Clever. Oh my, so the mural was here all along. It was never stolen. Oh yeah, you have an eternal, you have my eternal gratitude for everything we've done for my museum. Oh no, I was sure the plan was foolproof. We did it. 
Watching Unravel This Mystery was truly inspiring. You are our new great detective. And now this case is really close. Ooh, firehouse. Oh my gosh. You guys are making me so hungry. Oh, I miss two again. So Get it. Yeah, seriously. I've been having a craving for sushi lately. I've really I've there is a sushi place near me that I've been thinking of trying. It like opened up a few months ago, I think. I think anything's better than Subway too. It's crazy how Subway really like plummeted. Ugh. Cause I had a really bad experience my last time with Subway. I just never wanted, never went back. Especially when they said that the the sandwiches had like the same ingredients as yoga mats or something crazy like that. All right, we got one. Okay, I'm gonna pause real quick. I'm gonna go um, take a little break. And I'll probably get a snack too now. <laughs> I'll be right back, y'all. I'm gonna pause this real quick. Enjoy your dinner, though.
come back. <laughs> I'm reading y'all. I'm reading. I'm reading the chats. Y'all are too funny. Okay. Could no no gas station sushi for me. I'm not gonna be like that episode of Futurama. <laughs> <laughs> Fry gets that su old sushi. Oh my gosh. Hi, Orange. How are you? Princess Peach is fun. It is It is a nice, a very nice time. Like, I have so many. Like, I just love this so much. Yeah, I'm back. Just needed a drink of water. A little break. And it's not a gas station sushi place, though. So. It's like a, I actually just found out it's from like a, it's like a, not a chain, but it has another location. So I feel a little bit better because I kind of been sus about it because it just opened. So I kind of been looking like, is it a good <laughs> place to get sushi from? It is a little expensive though. But I usually get like the tempura shrimp sushi. Like I never really like the raw, the raw fish ones. Right, Peach is here. These have been so, all of these, these have been so much fun. You just, we just did Detective Peach. Um, let's see, which one should I do? <laughs> kind of sus. <laughs> oh my gosh, stop. <laughs> Where do you guys get your sushi from? <laughs> Not the gas station. Um, okay, let's see. What two should I do this time? Yeah, I don't really enjoy it. I think I've I've had a raw sushi before, like a salmon. I don't remember. I, I did have a raw sushi before, but I didn't, I don't like it. I like the, usually like the tempura or like the California rose, you know? Um, let's do sword. Let's do sword. Oh, ghosty castle. <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> <N> no. <laughs> I could not. I could not get sushi from a gas station. Like, can you imagine? Like, uh, unless it was like in Japan. Like, you go to Seven Eleven in Japan, but like here, no way. Okay, so we have a, another sword. Okay, it's a sword fight. And castles abandoned. Okay, cause I was wondering if this is like different. Oh, it was a ghost. The castle belongs to me now. Oh my. <laughs> Not a one star gas station. <laughs> Y'all are funny. All trespassers in my castle shall fall. Wow, what happened? Please, you got to help us. Those fiends locked us up with dark powers. Please get rid of them, we're counting on you. Okay, how am I supposed to get out of here? Okay, I can close the door down. Peach said, yeah, uh, everyone can catch the hands if you're a ghost or not. <laughs> Okay, that's free y'all peach has been slain okay we were ice skating peach like she she could she fights but she also still has her charm you know oh there's a lot of them <laughs> they have clean restrooms i can't what is so yeah i was like what's bucky's i never heard of it Oop, almost got me Oh, it's a Texas thing. But you want, okay, I will say there is a grocery store in Florida that has, that has good sushi Publix. That sushi is actually good. And they actually have like an actual person that makes it fresh. So I won't lie. There's a places that do, <laughs> it's not gas station, but still. 
Publix has everything. It's my favorite place in the world. I wish I had Publix where I was at. It's only in the south. There's something back here? I think that's it. <laughs> Not fresh. I don't, I don't. <laughs> I gotta see because where i where in where i grew up we didn't have japanese restaurant like the sushi restaurants you know so i didn't even have a lot of sushi growing up hey Can I do it? Okay, I see. I have to like wait for them to come around. <laughs> Stop! Oh my gosh. Oh, I did it. Okay. <laughs> I was like fighting them. <laughs> Not my guess that she switches stuff to their game. I can't. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you know, there's a Kira Sushi I've seen before too. I feel like I spent way too much money trying to get the gaptures. <laughs> You again, time to send you fly. Oh, I love this. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I did it. Oh. Wait, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Gotcha. I can't look at chatting y'all at the same time. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Every 15 plates. That's so crazy. I remember my niece was saying she went to one of those places and they spent so much money. <laughs> Got it. Okay, yeah, I was like, oh, was I doing something here? All right. Okay, so what we got going on? This kind of gives me Ocarina of Time. This is so interesting. Okay, I guess I must uh For real? 120? Yeah, I really feel like it gets you. Cause it's like they're like the plates are inexpensive. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here, y'all. Oh, okay, like that. Wait, what are the, what what <laughs> Okay, I see, so. Oop. 
I'm sure that the sushi in Japan is so good though. Gotcha. <laughs> Not there for the anime collabs. Oh, he switched, moved at the last second. Yeah, I, I, I had like a, I, I had a really small chewy bar. I'm like so weird about eating on stream. <laughs> I don't really like snacking on stream. But I had like a cereal bar thing. It was good. And I ate before stream too, so. I can't dodge this good. Okay, let's try one more time. I'm the better at these dodge. Yeah, it's cause he like does that weird angle. Maybe I should do it the other way. We gotta do the opposite of what he's doing, right? That's so strange, why can't I get it? <laughs> I feel so subconscious. I in general just don't like people watching me eat though. <laughs> so no mukbangs for me. <laughs> Wait, let me pause. Let me pause. What are you saying? <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, wait, wait. I missed I missed something. Okay, so you said Jurassic Park. <laughs> not not Godzilla. So Godzilla is just chilling in Shibuya. <laughs> That sounds so cool though. Okay, let's try this one more time. I can't, what, why can't I dodge him right? Maybe it's uh, something I have to press. I need Stella's help. It's like I dodge it, but it doesn't like hit him. Okay, that's what we're supposed to do. It's supposed to be A. I was like, there's something I'm doing wrong here. Woohoo, I did it. The Toho Cinema. <laughs> that was fun. What's that? Thank you very much. Woohoo, we got a ribbon for Stella. Even though I keep talking about the gas station sushi, I really do want some. I feel like I need to go find a place. I might go to that spot near me though. And there's a really fancy one that's um, near me too. Right? I love her moveset too. Oh, and I I got the um, I got this this for um the pre order from Best Buy. <laughs> Yo, stop! <laughs> it's a legit place, but you know what? You now you have me being more sus about it again because I really I like when it opened up. I was like, is this a legit place or like? <laughs> Cause when I, I would go to, to um over here there's K Town. I would go there and they have like this um like open like cafeteria hub that have different places. And that's why I always like to get like the they still have like the shrimp rolls and like the um what's it katsu rice and stuff like that. <laughs> a 
okay this this is from and marshmallow like somehow best buy actually came through because i was afraid i, I pre-ordered from best buy and they have this little standy so it's like you it's like a, you build it up you know so it, it was I, I i was like this is like a whatever but i built it and i think it's so cute it's a nice quality too oh oh my gosh did i break it okay <laughs> it's nice quality i like it and i was like i wish it wasn't um sword fighter peach but actually i think it's nice not slimy shrimp rolls i get the tempura <laughs> Okay, let's see. Thank you. Even though we didn't find the sword fighter sparkler, the play seems to be back to normal. What does this do? <laughs> I guess this will be my first. Wow, that's a lot. That belongs to the sword fighter sparkler. Yeah, I would usually do like when I have pre order from them, it has been Nintendo games. I, I guess that would make sense. But yeah, it's nice. It's like a nice quality. It's really thick. I'm definitely going to keep this on my desk. I think this is an, a nice little collectible. Ooh, Kimbap. Mmm, Kimbap's so good. I'm going to make my own sushi. I'm too lazy though. I heard Sparkle Spirit is given to actors entrusted with starring roles. This is amazing, Peach. It means you've been recognized as having a sword fighter spirit. Can anyone hear me? Sounds like it's coming from the basement. Let's go check there. <laughs> Not 70 million. You have to share your collection sometime. You know, it's so, um, this would be my first acrylic stand. I always see the ones for like the Tomei games, but I never get the collector's editions. So I haven't actually gotten any. What's going on now? Oh. It does. How strange, there wasn't anything like this in the basement before. Oh, I bet we can see things we couldn't before because you've been entrusted with the sword fighter spirit. I always see people make it because I like to watch a lot of um, like vlogs, like YouTube vlogs. I always see people making it and I always think it looks so cool, but I just, I don't know. I also saw someone do like a sushi bake one, but it's like, I feel like it's too many steps for me. <laughs> I cannot, y'all. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what are you saying, Jen? <laughs> oh my gosh. Anyone? Okay, this must be the sword fighter. Can anyone hear me? It's coming from there. All right, let's get in there. Mm -hmm. What are we doing now? <laughs> Y'all are too much. I don't think I have ninja fast powers to be catching fish bare handed. Y'all, okay? I don't know, like regular fishing. Okay, so what are we doing here? What's this? The stage is set so bizarre now. It's not like one of our plays at all. What are we doing here? We were talking about foraging last stream, but I told you 
It sounds good in theory. That's different from foraging though. <laughs> that's not berries. That's not berries and mushrooms out in the forest. <laughs> I already have I already know I'm not prepared for the apocalypse y'all okay I would like to I, I'm I, like as soon as I can't take a bath it's over it's not happening for me I'm not gonna do a walking dead I'm not surviving okay <laughs> I've already I've already told myself I know myself already someone please Oh, so this is like a mini level. Gotcha. I'm just gonna hit everything here. It's the sword fire to start a sparkler. Okay. Are we, do we have to fight them? Be careful, this place is... What's going on? Yep. <laughs> every time I watch, like I love watching apocalypse movies and every time I watch them, I'm like, there's no way that I would have survived y'all, okay? I like to, you know, I like to think like, oh, you know, I would be resourceful. It's just, What's the point, y'all? What are we fighting for? <laughs> what is nothing to, to live for? Like, seriously. <laughs> In the apocalypse, I mean. <laughs> okay, watch how he moves. I think I have to either... He'll block any frontal attacks you make, okay. Okay, so how am I supposed to block them? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Maybe if you, if you guys want to start a compound, okay. <laughs> I have no skills for survival, y'all. I don't even like bugs. I can't do it. I guess I should be jumping on him. Oop, my bad. He's building up power. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> oh, you know, I've been watching the new season, the spin off series, um, Walking Dead, and that's why I'm like, I can't do it. Whoa, what was that? And if it's a, if it's a zombie apocalypse, not, not doing it. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Thanks for the save. We got to escape. Oh, we, we're still doing stuff. <laughs> Y'all are funny. I'll block the sword. You attack this time. Oh, wait, wait. Am I doing this? Oh, okay. You, like, you guys remember at the beginning of lockdown when everybody was, like, rushing out to get, like, toilet paper? Like, that was, like, I was like, this is what it would be like? <laughs> 
it wasn't even that it wasn't it wasn't even that bad at that time that was fun Might as well I can't. Why though for real, real talk. Like it was it was like why? Like why are we doing this? Wait, can sushi? Who said this? <laughs> yeah, I cannot. <laughs> I can't. That sounds so gross. Who would have thought they'd imprison the sparklers on their own stages? I'm certain this means we can save the rest of the sparklers while we store in their place. Thank you both for saving me. They robbed me of my powers and trapped me. Those fiends. Now I'll resume my role of protecting others. Allow me to express my gratitude once more. Thank you. That was cool. What do we do now? Let's head back to the second floor. Oh, sorry. That <laughs> was like it was like I was like trying to talk, but then I started to like lose my breath at the same time. Like I don't know what that was. Like I was trying to take a breath. Um, I'm like, what is? What are these? So I guess if we defeat the other floors, we can unlock these. Okay, so there's extra gameplay things here. I cannot. <laughs> That's what everyone was doing. That was a wild time. And it was like, it was just like the most randomest thing to everyone, for everyone to start panic buying. All right, we're back. Okay, so that's the basement. I do wonder if there's a multiplayer here. All right, you guys, I'm gonna stop here. This has been fun. Oh, what do we have for our wardrobe? This has been so fun though. That sounds like too much work, Corgi. Oh, this is a cute outfit too. I really like the stripes. The stripes are adorable. This is so cute. I love it. Oh, I think I have one for her. Let's go for this. <laughs> how do we get here? How, how do we get here? <laughs> Oh my goodness well, i'm gonna switch my window over this is this is um such a fun game oh wait 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 um where am i going just chatting window <laughs> you color too much that's why I don't even want to visualize that. Okay, but that does that does make me wonder. <laughs> How does it work in the movies? I couldn't do it. I've read like um. Have you guys ever read this? This is actually a really dark book. Have you ever read a Parable of a Sower? I always like every time I think about the dystopian books, apocalyptic books. I think of this book by Octavia Butler. Oh my gosh, like. I read that book before 2020 and some of the stuff that happened in that book was really like a precursor and it was so traumatizing to read and then have every like the lockdowns and stuff that we had in 2020 oh my gosh it was so it was crazy but it, it I feel like it's like the perfect dystopian apocalypse book it's so eerie would zombies even be able to do that <laughs> wasn't it fun it really it really felt like each each like little area feels like a movie for sure they did a really they did such a good job with like the capturing like each level like it is a, it, it's like so 
like when I'm thinking about it, it's so different from any of the like platformer or like games that they've come out with. Like, you know, like with the Kirby, it's like you just have the level theme, but like to change Peach's like whole aesthetic based on each stage that she's on and she has like a different set of powers. Like, I think that is so like, it's very, really well done. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, zombies do not care. Y'all are funny. What do you guys think? I mean, I'm, I know this is an obvious answer, but like fast or slow zombies. <laughs> For like when I watch World War Z, I'm like the those types of zombies, like no. 28 days later, same thing. Running ones, no way. I think the Walking Dead zombies are probably the best ones because they walk so slow and it's so easy to like um get away you know it's like if you don't get like rushed by a bunch of them it's so easy to, to like go around them I cannot but if it's an apocalypse and it's a zombie apocalypse again not doing it <laughs> y'all I can't <laughs> Yeah, they're so scary. <laughs> Not in this scenario. There is, is no... <laughs> no, the ones like, oh, train a Busan zombies. Those ones can do gymnastics. <laughs> I could not. I prefer no zombies too, though. <laughs> if it's running ones, I just feel like it's, it's over. Like. Especially if they're easy, like the infection time is like really quick. Like if it's like how like 28 days later, it was like seconds. Like, oh no, I couldn't do it. But I just love watching zombie movies though. It's my favorite. <laughs> Nobody wants a T-Virus Doberman. Those, those dogs used to scare me in the games. Oh, they got trained. Oh, you saw behind the scenes. I should have looked. I have the DVD too. I should. Oh, I should see what kind of features they have on it. I watched that movie so many times, and every time I watch it, it's like I never watched it because <laughs> I'm always like, "Oh my gosh, run!" Like I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen. <laughs> I love Chernobyl. Son, it's my favorite. And I like Dawn of the Dead, the like 2004 one. I think Dawn of the Dead is also like it's like kind of like campy like how would i even describe that one it's an episode interesting <laughs> how are you gonna do that <laughs> there's probably an umbrella corporation same place that um <laughs> you mean what engine <laughs> oh 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 two okay I never watched two and specifically because I heard it wasn't good but also I thought it was random they decided to do a sequel to Train to Busan so I wasn't I didn't watch it even though I like every time I thought about watching it I was like I don't think I gonna be feeling it the same one okay it was bad okay yes <laughs> that's what I heard like I remember when I heard oh it was gonna be a sequel I was actually excited and then when I her like looked more into it i was like this is nothing like the first one like why is it being made it should have just been not even a sequel honestly oh she has dobermans how are you supposed to control this marshmallow <laughs> if you have a t-virus doberman <laughs> i would um but I have thought about just sometimes like just watching it, even though I heard it's bad. 
Because I, like, honestly, if I'm in the mood for, like, a bad zombie movie, I'll put it on. Like, it's crazy. It's, like, silly as it is, you know? <laughs> They're your niece and nephew. <laughs> I think it was a, the, and it wasn't the second train of Busan. It was, like, a different director altogether. I think it was, like, a whole different team, but they just said it was a C4. It was kind of random. The first one, I think, is just like the it's like the perfect movie like i always talk about how it's it, it's like the best like zombie movie and it's so sentimental at the same time like I, uh, it's so good and i like the main the main lead what did i see him in um coffee prints like because i saw him in k dramas before i watched him in that one and he's just so good you have to make the problem first. I cannot. <laughs> Maybe you can train it like Shaun of the Dead. You remember in Shaun of the Dead, they trained the zombies at the end to like do work. I think obviously that's probably the most realistic <laughs> thing of like a zombie apocalypse. Like instead of killing them all, you use them to do manual labor. <laughs> oh yeah, I have a TikTok. But it's like um, what usually... I haven't been posting as much shorts, but whatever I post on shorts, like on the YouTube feed, is what I'm posting on TikTok. I don't really do anything different. I have thought about doing like talking videos, but I feel like I feel like TikTok is a little mean. <laughs> I don't really like I don't really like like um you know, I feel like I don't I don't wanna post a lot of content on TikTok because some sometimes the comments are kind of rude. <laughs> it's kind of annoying, you know. Ah, uh, yeah. Just in case spoilers, yes. I know, but the ending of Train to Busan is like, watching that is so crazy because it's like, you're like scared, but at the end you're like also like, why do I feel sad? <laughs> the Reaper? What's that? In Ghoul. I know. But I feel like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I'm on TikTok a lot. But I when I read the comments for stuff, I feel like it's like a different type of, like, the, like, I don't know what you'd say. It's like, <laughs> I've seen people joking on TikTok. Like, so someone goes on TikTok, right? They talk about a tragic story. And they'll be like, oh, man, this crazy thing happened to me. And blah, blah, blah. And then you read the comments. And people will be like, Oh man, that's crazy. What's your lip combo? Oh, your makeup looks so good. How'd you do it? When they talk about a tragic story, like that's what I mean. It's like the dissociation on TikTok is different from anywhere else. <laughs> it's so bad. Oh, and I watched Snowpiercer before. Oh, wait, but Snowpiercer, what came out first? I thought Snowpiercer came out first. Wait, let me look. Snowpiercer is the same director of um, Parasite, I believe. Okay, Snowpiercer came out in 2013. I remember watching Snowpiercer and I was like, this is like so random because I was like, it's my, it's like a Korean movie, but it's not since it has like all these um, English actors in it. Actually, Snowpiercer came out first. And then Train of Busan came in 2016. <laughs> yeah, it really does. Uh, I, 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 yeah, I'm just, uh, I really, I do like, I do like, I love YouTube. Everyone over here, you guys are so awesome. And so it's like, it's, a, it's like a nice, a nice like vibe over here. <laughs> but yeah tiktok is it can be a little unhinged i notice the in-game investigation but what do you mean <laughs> oh my gosh but you're saying you knew that it had um a korean director or you didn't know <laughs> Not the rest in chat. 
Aw, oh, thanks, Jen. <laughs> Aw, oh, thanks. You guys are the best. All of you. It's so it's it's so fun. I really love and I especially love that I started streaming because that's how I get to talk to all of you guys. It's just like having like a big friend chat. <laughs> Oh, you didn't know the Snowpiercer director? Yeah, he is really famous. I believe it's the same one as Parasite, if I can recall. Because I remember it was the Parasite has the same type of vibe as Snowpiercer with like the class system they have going on, like the back of the train, the front of the train, like that type of stuff. Like it has the same like rhetoric or what would you call it? Like ideals. I, I thought Snowpiercer was good, but I i did it i remember watching it it's not something that i want to rewatch, but i remember it wasn't bad i watched it like a really long time ago oh that's fine i was like that too when i first started streaming my heart would be be beating like crazy <laughs> and i would like have to like okay okay and then i just press the button i used to be so like nervous <laughs> what do you mean <laughs> I'm not, I'm not doing gas station sushi, y'all. <laughs> yeah, you'll get it. And now when I, I log on, it's fine. I'm like, okay. But I remember when I did first start, I was like, you just got to do it. <laughs> y'all are funny. <laughs> um, okay, I started streaming around the time that Zelda came out so last year like May but then I didn't stream again for like another three months and so I started like streaming like regularly October I think it was like around October so it has been like six months or so maybe a little bit over that you have us orange don't forget and if you're doing it you're doing it just you didn't like it's like putting yourself out there it's like everybody it like it it, it comes you know because i've been doing youtube for like i realized like, like kind of like i started in 2021 but it was like really really like um sporadic at first like i didn't really know what i wanted to put out but i like i'm happy i'm really happy that i decided to do youtube but i get what you mean i just like i block as soon as I feel uncomfortable, if someone like makes me feel uncomfortable, I block them like right away. So. And you're right, Marshmallow. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Hilarious. But I only stream, Jen, I only stream over here on YouTube. I might do Twitch sometime, but I don't really know how to do the joint Twitch feeds. And I also, I don't think I have the, like, the, what would you call it? The bandwidth. <laughs> I hate that word. I don't think I have the, like, I can't do both, you know? Like, I feel like if I was reading two different chats, I would be kind of, like, overwhelmed, you know? Yeah, definitely. I feel like I, I have a pretty good, like um what you call it like i get like really good vibes from people you know so like when people start like if it's a new person in chat i can kind of tell like okay they're cool like right away but then there there are some that i haven't had a lot but you know very small percentage that i'm like no <laughs> it's just gonna block you and I, even even if i didn't what if i was like questioning myself at first i'm like no Oh, really? I feel like Twitch is just weird to stream on for me personally because I know they have like, they have like a type of incentive program. Um, it's like you have that like 75 viewers day, like every time you stream or something. Like, I don't know, it just feels like a little bit more to me. Like, I, I just, I think it's chill over here on YouTube to stream, you know? Yeah, I really, I really like YouTube, even though I don't, I do wonder about like how um, interactive it is on Twitch, because I don't, I know there's like more like things you can do with Twitch over there, 
but I really like I like I like this space. <laughs> but thanks, Jin. <laughs> now you're here for food memes. <laughs> We're also always gonna end up talking about food for some somehow. Yeah, I like it. It's nice. I do feel like, um, also Twitch is like weird to stream on, like to try to, um, gain an audience. Like, I don't like, like after, like what I saw on Twitch is like, you have your video, like on YouTube, I'm streaming with you guys right now, but this video is going to be up after, you know? So like after I finish the stream is always going to be here. So anyone who wants to watch who didn't get to catch like the stream or whatever can come back. But like on Twitch, I think it um, stops after like a week or something like that. So like it like deletes the video unless you save it. I don't like that either. It feels so like not long term. Not suspicious food locations. <laughs> oh my gosh. Isn't it? Yeah, that's what I feel like. That's what that from when I was researching. Like, I do have like an account on Switch, but I was when I was looking it up, I was like, oh, I don't really like this. <laughs> and and yeah, you're right, Marshmallow. I feel like it. It's like if I so if I'm on YouTube and I have like a lot of people watching, um, like if I have like a big following, you know, and I start a Twitch and a lot of people go over there then that's probably how Twitch would work. Cause like I noticed with Twitch, uh, I've heard a lot of people say like, if you're a small streamer, it doesn't really push you up, you know? You can say them as highlights. Oh, I see. Interesting. I have seen that, but I didn't know what the, what that means. Oh, okay. Okay. That's good to know then. And I do Twitch for Treasure Islands too. <laughs> it's been a minute i was just thinking i'm gonna actually go back on my island because um it's been like four years since animal crossing released and i was like oh, it would be kind of cool to do like a island tour but i still have like a whole bunch of halloween stuff up so <laughs> i have to go back and fix it okay that's good to know though francine because i thought it was like a like i i like twitch is just a little bit different um for me to like wrap my head around Oh, okay. That makes sense too. Interesting. Do you so do you like Twitch or do you like YouTube better, Francine? Are oh, you like Switch? Hmm, okay. Uh, that makes sense too. I think if I did Switch, I'd probably do a joint. It depends on how I feel. Oh, you find Minecraft? Oh, okay. Yeah, you know, the I do see like they have like the trending. Is it like you go through the trending games tab? And that's how you find games. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you marshmallow what? <laughs> Thanks, Jen. But I'm staying on YouTube for right now. I, I like it's like all the social medias. Like I barely like I'm on Instagram and TikTok, but it's like <laughs> 
try to juggle between all the social medias it can be a task <laughs> okay that's good to know and i yeah usually when i go on twitch i can unless it's someone that i found through like tiktok or if i follow them on instagram that's how i usually watch them but like i never i've never like gone on twitch to like actively search maybe i should maybe i should rent, like you know just be like see what's streaming over there you know just like be an active participant i guess <laughs> Yeah, it really is. It seems like it's easy because like everyone sees the end product. It is so much. Oh my gosh. When it comes to like um, posting and all that. It's the editing. Your first adult summer vacation. But I see. I get what you mean, Marshmallow. Because same. Thanks, Jen. Yeah, but I will. I will. I'll look. I'll check it out. I won't try to like put it off. You know, like um. Sometimes I like to be, like set. Like I get one tracked. You know. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I I I'm gonna be honest. I like. I Sorry, every time I talk about lockdown, do you guys, I don't know if you guys ever saw this, but like, do you guys remember Vanessa Hudgens during 2020 when she was like, um, they had canceled Coachella and she went on, on like live or something and was just like, I mean, I'm sorry. It's so, so insensitive now. But when she said it, I said, well, everybody came at her. And I was like, the way everyone talks about like, lockdown now is so different she's like i mean people are gonna die like it's inevitable <laughs> like how she's if you look up that clip it cracks me up every time because i was like low-key she was like she was like ahead of her time because no one talks about like covid and stuff now or like treats it as like as serious as we did before oh you're furloughed but if you guys look up that Vanessa Hudgens clip, I crack up every time I think about it. <laughs> it was so, it was so insensitive. It was so insensitive. Yeah, she was. Cause she like that. I remember during that time, like Coachella, the only time I heard about like, like Vanessa Hudgens was like, when she was at Coachella like you know Coachella was like the it thing at the time so like everybody would it was like social media you know but then when it got locked down she was so upset about it like <laughs> but it always cracks me up because she goes like I mean it's inevitable and she's like I don't, I don't know maybe I, maybe I shouldn't be on here <laughs> it was clear she was like in lockdown and bored and <laughs> just put live on her phone it was like oh dang <laughs> people really came at her for that it was so much stuff that happened. <laughs> but it, it's just how she says it that always cracks me up. Because, like, why would she say that? <laughs> why would she say that? Like, it was a serious situation at the time. But it's just like, why would you get on, on live and say, say something like that? Oh, my gosh. It was so funny. I think about it all the time. The internet never forgets, okay? It's always forever. That digital, that internet footprint is never leaving. <laughs> but it is, it is, um, to me, <laughs> it's such a funny moment. Oh, goodness. So that's all I think about every time I think about Vanessa Hudgens. Not High School Musical. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that is, that was so crazy too. I still wear a mask, even though like when I, like no one, no one around me, not really. Like no one in public, I mean, you really wears a mask. I feel like they look at me kind of crazy, but I, 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 you know, I've been, um, I feel like wearing a mask has, I haven't gotten as sick as I used to, you know? So I definitely, I wear a mask every time I go out. Like, if I'm in big, big public, like, you know, going to the store, like, stuff like that. I'm wearing a mask. 
it's so crazy how quickly everything changed you know i'm like why are we talking about this i'm like yeah because march it's like been four years y'all yeah for right now but it became like such a like weird political thing that it's like <laughs> like you know it's like it shouldn't have been like so the like, disgust like it was like you know it's just like you're trying to look out for people or people who are like you know compromised or you know yeah where are the more in public places No, I definitely get it. Same here. I get it, yeah. I usually just like to, like, if I'm outside, I'm fine. But if I'm, like, because like, I usually, like, ride trains and stuff like that, I wear a mask. And when I go into grocery stores, like, movies, I usually have a mask on. But I like the N95 ones because, I, like, I used to have the, like, fabric ones and it's like i could not breathe with those on and it, and it's also hard to talk in the hermit life is the best life orange <laughs> by the way <laughs> yeah it was it's a wild time but you want to know what's the best about that animal crossing okay i got my real life in animal crossing <laughs> during that time Oh, really? Oh, be safe over there. There have been a lot of random, like, um, infection things, like, circulating. Thanks, Francine. Thanks for being here, for being on the stream. Have a good night. I hope you got your steps in, too. This is a fun stream. Yeah, wishing all of you guys the best of health. Do you guys have any plans this weekend? You did? Nice. <laughs> I'm glad. Oh, that's the worst. Be safe out there. I don't have I don't have any plans this weekend, actually. I'm pretty cool with that. <laughs> like i i was like maybe i'll go out maybe i'll probably go out for a walk or something it depends on how i feel it's been the weather has been nicer like lately because i don't like ugh. oh wait actually it's gonna rain tomorrow i'm not going anywhere <laughs> the weather has been been it's spring has been fighting for its life around me okay Cause it's like saying it's spring, but it, it was like crazy cold, like the past few days and windy spring has, is, is like not, it's not fighting back right now. <laughs> oh, are you going to clean? Nice. I like, oh, it's so, it's so good when you get like a deep clean in, you know, I might touch grass. I, I might touch grass. Maybe. <laughs> Oh, you're going to Japan, Baristic. I missed that one. Oh, awesome. Have fun. You're right, though. No plan is also a plan for sure. Have fun, Baristic. Do you like, do you have like an itinerary of what you want to do? Or like, are you just going to try to fill out what you want to go see? He plans to have no plan though. Yeah, I usually since tomorrow is if if it's still gonna be a rainy day, I like to just kind of like chill. I probably watch a movie or something. Oh, I watched Poor Things recently, and that was probably the most randomest movie I ever seen in my life. And I've seen some random ones, and I'm I, Poor Things was so interesting. <laughs> it's a movie. I don't even know what to describe it is. 
yeah just you know take your time marshmallow <laughs> oh yeah you're going for school i forgot you said that you're going for school baristic all right all right hopefully you get to do some fun things out there and be safe Yeah, I like to try, if if I'm trying to, like, clean up stuff, I try to take it, like, I'll checklist it, you know, like, I'll be like, okay, I'll do this, like, wash these clothes or, like, do this, and it's, like, it makes it easier to get done instead of, like, if I start to feel overwhelmed trying to do everything. Now, poor things is so, <laughs> it's so weird, y'all, because I looked up, I kept seeing the um, trailers for it and i was like okay emma stone doing some kooky things and mark ruffalo and then i looked up what it was about and i was like i'm still confused I'm very confused because <laughs> it's like a frankenstein-esque movie like it's like a kind of like a reverse frankenstein like instead of it being like a man it's like a woman kind of like that like similar vibe I don't really want to say if it's like like it's it, it I feel like there is a lot of commentary in it but it's just a lot oh I get what you mean marshmallow you gotta be recondo you have to do a Marie Kondo with, your, with the house <laughs> you have to be like does this bring me joy Yes, yes. And I was like, I looked, I remember looking it up and I was like, I don't know if that, like it was, it was something, the poor things. <laughs> Cause I was like, why is it, it's like a woman with a baby's brain. It's like, that's why it's like a Frankenstein thing. Like, I, I don't know, it's very um, quirky. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I remember when I did, like, I was into the Marie Kondo and I threw out a bunch of stuff. <laughs> and then I kind of was like, oh, maybe I needed some of it. I think the best time when you're throwing stuff out is when you're moving. Because it's like your brain switches off and suddenly nothing you have you care about. You just throw it all out where you can't figure out what to do with it. That's pretty much what happened with me. <laughs> Yeah, you looked it up, Orange. It's really strange. And it's like really like um hypersexual. Like it gets like really weird. <laughs> but it got in it got all like um Emma Stone won an Oscar for her acting, which I do agree. I would agree with I I mean she was a good actor, um actress in it. And uh, like the other movies, I um I know there the someone said that um killer of the flower moon they wanted the um lily gladstone she's like the native american actress in that to win um but i still haven't seen it yet and that movie's like three hours long it's a lot Yeah, it won a lot of awards. What else won this year? Um, what was the like? I can't remember what the oh Oppenheimer. I didn't watch that either. Oh my gosh, Oppenheimer's too long. Too long. I think people need to know how to edit movies better because my attention span is not giving. Three when as soon as I see two hours and change for a movie, I'm clocked out. I'm like, I need an intermission. <laughs> What are we doing here? I I think it was, was it a lot? It was a lot, right? Because I was like, I think it won best picture, not best picture. I think it won like best call. It's supposed to be a comedy. I think it's also mislabeled. I don't consider it like it was funny parts, but it was like a little bit more disturbing to me, especially like with the commentary that's going for.
Like, seriously, no. Like, why are movies so long? It's insane. Like, I can't watch... Like, I, the last movie I did watch was um, Spider-Man, the Spideyverse, the new Spider-Man movie, the the um, Into the Spideyverse, the Miles Morales. And I had to, like, watch one hour and then watch it the next <laughs> hour the next day because sitting down for two hours, it's a lot. And it was a good movie, but no way. I, that's why I can't go to a movie, like, the movie theaters. I haven't watched, going to the movies to watch, like, a really long movie in a really long time. Oh, yes, yes. I always forget to say that. Yeah, make sure you guys like the stream. <laughs> I always, like, forget to, like, keep to say to do that. Because, you know, it's like the algorithm. That's how it knows <laughs> you like this stream. <laughs> I really do. I do. <laughs> it's like, That's how I've been recently. I just can't. Two hours is so long. I actually did the same thing with poor things because it's like two hours and change. So I actually just finished, <laughs> just finished that recently. Oh, you think so? I see what you're saying. <laughs> I think mine has hit Lord of the Rings territory actually. <laughs> Now I actually check how long a movie is, so I just know how long. I'm at. But what's funny is I won't like a two-hour movie, but I will binge watch a six six episode series. I don't know how the logic works. It just what happens. <laughs> I'll look at a movie like two hours, no way. But a series that's seven and forty-five minutes each, I'll watch it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I can't do six. I can't do six hours. I could, like, three hours, I think, is my good capping time. <laughs> yeah, sometimes if it is, you're right. Then you're like, oh, you watch it, you're like, okay. That's how it's sometimes. I used to, like, when I used to be super into K-dramas, I used to be clocked in k dramas are like an hour and change i will be watching those things until the wee hours of the night <laughs> and i'll be like one more episode because it always ends on a cliffhanger for some reason that but i don't know how the logic works it's just how it is <laughs> but yeah if it's sometimes i'll watch something and i'll be like okay and then i'll look at like check the timer i'm thinking oh this is how much time we got left we still have an hour <laughs> yeah it depends yeah i definitely feel that i feel like um like the editing, like I always think of like, what do they do in the editing process? When I see a movie that's three hours, it don't even feel like they tried. <laughs> Isn't Dune two like three hours and some change? Cause I think I saw someone post it like the full editing program, like how it was edited, it looked crazy. Hey Miko, we're just doing wind down chat. Like I, I'm, I'm um, finished streaming with Princess Peach, it was fun. I've been wanting to watch a new K-drama. There is one called Marry My Husband that I think seems cool. It's kind of like a time travel thing. <laughs> yeah, these are Hello Kitty. These are the ones from Razor. Um, I believe they're still available. I like them for streaming. They're nice for, they're good streaming headphones. I have been wanting to watch a K-drama. But it's like, do I have the time to invest in this? I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, I know you said you were at work. Thanks for coming for checking in though. 
yeah i heard the dune books are very a lot <laughs> and confusing i've heard forecasting weather and love oh that sounds good really oh i really miss i used to be so good at binge watching stuff but i don't i'm not good at it anymore like i can't stay up like watching stuff because i feel horrible in the morning like if i stay up too late yeah, it's not good yeah i usually do i mean recently i feel like the past few streams i've been doing it But I don't know. I might watch Dune too. I watched Dune. I did. It was okay. <laughs> Dune two. I haven't seen it, but I hear it's better than the first one. I didn't feel like it was crazy long too. <laughs> you went to see Fast Seven. <laughs> Are you watching? Wait, wait. You've been watching Naruto in One Piece? I've been actually wanting to watch One Piece because I watched the Netflix series and actually really liked the live action. Like, it was so good. It actually was like, oh, okay, because I didn't know what the heck One Piece was about, honestly. I haven't been to watch the anime in a minute. You had Max? Oh my gosh, seriously? They've been really going crazy with the streaming service prices. Do you have like late, like, so how, <laughs> I'm looking at what you said, Miko, though. Oh, I never thought about that. Maybe. I have thought about doing like movie nights or something with um Discord. I just have to like, I'm just, I feel like something disorganized. <laughs> But I do, uh, that That sounds fun. I'll definitely um, think about that one. Thanks, Miko, for the suggestion. Yeah, the, the One Piece live action was so good. One Piece got over a thousand episodes, okay? You gotta buckle in for that one. <laughs> what I felt, that's why I haven't watched it. I used to see it come on TV, and I used to kind of like the animation was like a little bit weird. Like, because they were like really long-limbed. And I just never watched it because I didn't know what it was about. I just saw pirates. But watching the live action, I was like, oh, this is really good. And they actually did a good job. Like, that's crazy. Because I heard the Avatar Netflix live action isn't good. <laughs> that is nice for Rustic. <laughs> you spread very thin. Yeah. It's like a... Life in doing this is a lot. <laughs> oh my gosh, it was Linky Pirates. <laughs> That's why I didn't watch it. But also Zoro, the live action Zoro on One Piece. Oh, I love him, okay? <laughs> oh my gosh. You liked it? Did you watch the original Avatar? Cause like, I think a lot of people didn't like it because they watched the, those TV series. So, it's like watching that and then watching live action and kind of like it never no no one's happy with anything you know like when anything that's, that's like an animated beloved thing gets like live action no one ever is like can agree they like it <laughs> i heard that is a little serious i haven't um i've been wanting to rewatch the original anime i mean avatar the last airbender though it's been a minute you watched it hmm because i have like i've heard mixed reviews like i've heard some people say they like it and other people were like no people do get serious about the nostalgia like crazy it is something else i mean i think for sure the live action um <laughs> m night Shalomon one <laughs> that was bad that was bad. I was like, I feel like they probably do a better job with this one. 
you thought it was entertaining i think a lot of people just felt like the characters were a little bit um the characterizations are different from the tv series so that's why they were like kind of not into it oh my gosh i never even watched the live action yu yu i'm not doing that i like i like watching the anime yu yu hakushu i didn't even try to look i didn't forget they had the live action Oh, it's Marshmallow said they watched it. <laughs> Miko. I can't watch. I can't. Um, I don't know. I wasn't sure about that one. You liked it. It was good. Ooh, maybe I should have checked that one out. I shouldn't have Netflix right now. I just, I just ended my <laughs> subscription to it. Oh, you should watch the the original anime. It's so good. It's like um, it's such a weird anime to describe. <laughs> but it, um, Yu Yu Hakusho is like um the main character guy. He saves his kid from getting hit by a car, and then he ends up like um dying. <laughs> and i don't that's not funny but he ends up dying and has to like get his soul back or tries to like like he's like in a coma and he has to get um his spirit back or something like that that's how like that's the premise like the beginning of it it's really good it's a really good anime i like it If that was the case, that would, a lot of people probably would be out, okay? <laughs> yeah, they are. And that, no, Yu Yu is so like, <laughs> when I'm watching the English dub, I crack up every time because the stuff that he says is so out of pocket, like calling old women hags, like <laughs> he just did not care. Y'all really did. I wouldn't have made the Discord if it wasn't for Orange and Marshmallow. <laughs> oh my goodness. You should buy- so what kind of enemies are would you be into? <laughs> oh my gosh. Orange is- Orange is, is stranger in the chat in the- um... <laughs> Yeah, Orange has a different name in Discord. Cause this is um oh, make sure you follow marshmallow and orange by the way i forgot to say that because they both have these are both their youtube channels it is it is cute button go i have never heard of that yeah when do you have the time all right, Jin. Bye. I'm about to be in the stream soon anyway. I feel like I, I did a little, little bit over my wind down today. <laughs> but I don't have any plans, so. Bye, Jin. Have a good night. Thanks for, thanks for being in the stream today. Yeah, you're welcome. I need to see more stuff, Marshmallow. I need the taxi driver. Um, What was it? The taxi cab simulator? <laughs> You have a good weekend too, Jen. Yeah, this is so fun. I'm gonna be back on Sunday. I I I'm going into my Stardew Valley era, so I'm gonna be streaming Stardew Valley on Sunday. <laughs> I started doing the mods, and now I'm like obsessed. Okay. Yeah, check out chat, y'all. Night, Jen. Yeah, I'm gonna say goodnight too. I'm gonna go eat dinner and whatnot. Catch something to watch on the TV. <laughs> if money have the time, I'm bullying you slightly. <laughs> I do wanna see it though. I feel like Euro Truck Simulator has been on sale like every time we always like, oh, you need to get it. We <laughs> never pick it up. <laughs> Oh my gosh. 
But yeah, I'm gonna end stream here. This was fun. You guys have a good weekend. I'll see you guys on Sunday. I think I'll stream like a little bit late on Sunday. But yeah, thanks for being here in the stream, you guys. This was so fun. Have a good night. And good morning to you, Orange. <laughs> Bye, you guys. All right, I don't want to end abruptly. <laughs> Bye, you guys. Have a good night.